What's up guys? Uh, I'm here with the BC Rich ASM Pro guitar review, which is uh, the guitar that I play in pretty much all of my videos except for a few where I use the Jackson. But um, this I've been getting a lot of questions on this guitar, if I like it, uh, how's it sound? well you already know how it sounds, um, how it plays, what, is it good or not. Uh, and I'm just going to answer all those questions in this video. This is the guitar, as you probably already know. Um, I'll break this up into a couple parts. The first one, will, I'll be just going over specs, basically what the guitar has to offer. I'll give you my opinions on the guitar, and uh, yeah, so I hope you enjoy this and I hope it's uh, helpful. Okay, so here is the guitar itself. Uh, I don't know, my camera doesn't have that great of quality, but as you can see, it has two EMG pickups. This is an 81, and that's an 85. It's also got a Floyd Rose original bridge, not the licensed one, and this is the original with the bar. It's got one tone, a three-way toggle, and one volume knob. Oop, wrong way. Um, the, a lot, another question is, people are saying that it has like two strap bars on the bottom. It only has one. Uh, I know in the uh, pictures it shows it has two, but it really does only have one. Alright, that's the headstock. The locking nut going down a 24 fret ebony fretboard with uh, diamond inlays which are very nice I don't know if you can see them on the camera fretboard's kinda dirty sorry about that um, flipping it over getting the strap out of the way we have a full neck through with this nice like beveled out for your hand so you can reach up to the high frets a lot easier uh, spring compartment uh, compartment for like the uh, controls and the pots and the battery compartment and uh, this is the back of it very nice alright alright so my basic opinion about the guitar is that well every guitar it, guitarist is gonna love their guitar and I'll tell you what I love this thing um, the Floyd Rose stays in tune very well. Like you can do dive bombs and uh, pull ups and everything. It'll just stay in tune. It will never get knocked out of tune, tuning unless you like mess with the nut up here. Um, it's a pretty thin neck, and uh, that's really good for playing fast. And uh, it's really smooth. It's nice to play on. The EMGs give great sound. Um, you probably know that if you watch my videos. You can uh, get an idea of what this thing sounds like, and uh, it's just a an all-out beautiful guitar. It's not like a really shiny silver; it's more of a subtle silver, and it's got this black binding around the outside. And uh, all in all, it's a great guitar. I highly recommend this to anybody who wants a very like well-made, good-sounding guitar for not a whole lot of money. I got mine for I believe seven hundred dollars from the website Beyond Eleven. I might link it in the description box uh, so you can go find it and I will post a video response down there of uh, some of my videos so you can get an idea of the sound of this thing. And uh, yeah, now I'll just show you what it looks like.